Hey, um, this is a guitar tutorial for Dummy Discard the Heart by Deer Hooks. It's a really fun tuner there, so like most of them. Um, it's in standard tuning, but it's slightly sharp, um, so you go up sort of between E and E flat about halfway. Um, and so, yeah, everything's uh, relative, um, but yeah, just a bit sharp. Um, so the first section. mistakes it sounds good um, so it's pretty simple um, so it's just on the G string 7 and 5 and you just walk it down uh, 7 6 5 and you do that twice and then you flatten your, um, your third finger and so you want to bar the uh, seventh fret on the G and B strings. And you do that sort of little chromatic down as well. So the same uh, flattened seven G and B, then the six on the G and B, and then the five on the G and B. Um, yeah, and that gets repeated a couple of times throughout the song, um, and then that leads into sort of the power chordy uh, verse section. Um, so all power chords, uh, starting on F, so it'll be low E on the first fret and third fret on the A string. And then you just slide that over, so you get three on the low E, five on the A. And you go up three frets to the sixth fret, low E, and eighth fret on the A. Then you repeat the first two, slide again, and then you hit the uh, sixth fret power chord again, and then you move it over to the eighth fret. Uh, so you get eight on the low E and ten on the A, and then you move that over two frets again to tenth fret on the low E and twelfth fret on the A. You just play them twice, and so all together that's. Then it goes into the high sort of melody line. Um, this bit, even though it's up and down the neck a bit, it's just the same shape moved everywhere, uh, which makes it nice and simple. Um, so starting on the 13th fret on the B string, you want to slide it over two frets to 15, and it's this little shape, which is just sort of two frets apart, one string apart. So uh, sorry, 15 on the B string, and then 13 on the high E. Then you slide that over two frets, starting on the B string. So you get 17 and 15. B and E, and you slide that over two frets again, so you get 19 on the B and 17 on the high E, and then you just sort of want to uh, pull off 19 to 17 on the high A, high E, not high A, and then uh, uh, 20 to 17 on the high E. So that bit all together. Um, you play that twice, and then you do similar sort of thing, but going down the neck. So again, starting on the 13th fret on the B string. 
um, you slide down two frets to 11. And then it's that same little shape um, that we use. So 11 and then nine on the high E. Slide it down two frets again. So the B string goes down to the ninth fret. And then high E is the seven. Down again two frets, so seven on the B string and five on the high E. And you just play that through twice. Um, then it goes into the, uh, the vocal line, which is just on the high E, uh, tenth fret. And you play t two notes on the seventh fret on the high E, and then eighth fret on the B. Um, play that twice. Then you just move that shape down um, two frets. So you're starting on the eighth fret. So eight on the high E. Two, you play twice on the fifth fret on the B on the high E, sorry, and then sixth fret on the B. Um, and then it's just an E power chord with the uh, open low E string. So it's just open low E, seventh fret on the A string, ninth fret on the D, and ninth fret on the G. And you sort of like punk rock strum that all down strokes. <laughs> Um, yeah, um, um, so it's just that E power chord and then just an A power chord. So that's fifth fret on the low E, uh, seventh fret on the A and seventh fret on the D string. And you just sort of follow the rhythm of that. Um, and then it pretty much just repeats all that stuff, um, just the very end section. Um, um, which is just sort of like a major interval. Um, so just on the low E, six, sixth fret, and then seventh fret on the G string. And you sort of wanna strum the four strings so that the two in between that you don't play but you just keep them muted. And then sort of the melody note at the top. And you just slide that down two frets and then back up two frets. Um, yeah, and then it's just some power chords right at the end. Um, so that's just, um, so low E is second fret. Then fourth fret on the A and D strings. That A power chord, so five, seven, seven on the low E, A and D. So then you do eighth fret down to seventh fret. Power chord, so that's eight, ten, ten, seven, nine, nine, and then you just finish on that uh, E power chord, open E, then seven on the A string, uh, nine, nine on D and G. And yeah, I think that's pretty much all the parts of that song. Um, yeah, hope you enjoy it. Play along. Have fun. <laughs>